Hmm. Yeah. Uh, never would have thought I would have actually been due. Or, that was perfect English, good job, kid. I never thought I would actually do one of these types of videos ever, but... Eh. I thought maybe I'd give it a try. Alright, so, yeah. Let's see if I remember how to do this. Hmm, yeah. Dang. One year ago. It's actually a little bit, like, a year and a half ago. I can't believe it's actually been that long. So yeah, what is up guys? You all know your boy Firefly here, or hopefully you still know. Yeah, I'm not dead, although there have been... Here, let's actually click on the video and see how many people... Comments waiting approval, that's fine. Or are you dead? Rest in peace, Firefly. Five months since... <laughs> Oh, sorry, you guys probably can't even see the comments. Oops. Are you dead? Rest in peace, Firefly. And one year ago, he's, this guy says it's been five months. I don't know, duplicate comment. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy, this is a little bit... A little bit, uh... A little bit embarrassing, if I do say so myself. So... Yeah. But I'm not dead. It's just been a while. But yeah. I should probably get into explaining where I what's been going on, huh? Yeah. I got a little piece of paper with me, so I don't, you know, just ramble on like I have been for the past couple of minutes. All right. So yeah, most of you probably thought I was dead, but I am not dead, yay. But you guys are probably wondering where I've been, so. Uh, to s put it simply, I really don't know. I really don't know why I kind of stopped just doing YouTube. I, mo partly because I think the biggest reason is because I kind of, it's not really that I got bored of YouTube. I just sort of, and I didn't even get bored of playing video games to be honest, because for a long time I really just been trying to convince myself that I've been getting bored of playing video games, but that really wasn't the case at all. Because, here, if you look through my channel, you'll kind of actually see why. Oh, this, these guys have brought back a few memories. Amateur Surgeon Christmas, Amateur Surgeon Part 1, Amateur Surgeon 2, and Amateur Surgeon Part 2. So, yeah. Uh, to put it simply, I got so caught up in this that I wasn't really having that much fun. And that's the thing with playing video games and starting a YouTube channel. It's sort of you really have to be sort of playing stuff that you like or sort of be doing stuff that you enjoy because for a long time when I was like really small and you know five five thousand subscribers or five and a half thousand subscribers there's nothing this needs that but when I was really small like let's say I had like 50 subscribers I was just focused solely on trying to get people to watch my content and I to be honest I almost didn't even do amateur searching because I just thought nobody would even watch this and it's just me you know just doing some weird sort of puzzle-like stuff, but it's nothing too special. I didn't even want to really do this, but then I just posted a video, and then I just saw that the views exploded on these videos, and I just thought, okay, I'll keep doing it, and to be honest, there are more games out there that I would have a lot more fun playing. Like, even, like Hitman Blood Money, even though it's like probably not one of my more viewed, uh, uh, you know, series on my channel, I still enjoy playing the game a lot, so I should, I probably would, you know, finish the series if I want to. And that's the thing also, whenever I, you know, start a series on this channel, if I'm not having fun with the game, I'm sort of feel bad about, you know, not finishing it because if some people are watching the series and I just sort of leave them hanging, I just kind of feels like a dick move on my part. So whenever I start a series, I feel like I'm morally obligated to finish it. So that's the thing with me, you know, starting, you know, a game that I'm not 100% sure that I'll enjoy playing. If I don't enjoy playing it, I'll sort of think, you know, I'm gonna have to finish it anyway because that's, there's some, at least one person on the internet that's watching my, that series. And even though I may not 100% enjoy uh, playing it, I still have to finish it, so, yeah. 
I can, and even like one of my more recent videos, like I can't actually believe how often I did this because it would actually happen so many times where I would take like a small break from YouTube and then I would like come back and say that I'm not actually dead. And to me, that's actually like kind of sad that I actually keep doing that because I would get like bored of like, like just flat out playing games on this channel that I didn't like. And then I would have to come back a little bit later and just like, I would have to actually take a break from playing video games if you could believe that. But so what's, what, what has to happen from this point forward is even if I start a series, and I know this might sound like really, really bad if I do this. If I start a series, and if I'm like even like really, really close to finishing it, I could, well, I could be like really close to finishing it, or I could just be starting the series. If I'm not enjoying playing the, playing the game, I have to just sort of stop playing it. Because if I'm not having fun playing the game, then I know that I'm not going to finish it. And, or I'm, I'm not going to, you know, uh, upload videos consistently as a result. And as, if that happens, then you guys won't see any more of my videos and that's gonna be really sad and I might go off of the internet for one and a half years like you guys have just witnessed recently. Am I holding my camera freaking sideways? Holy crap. Yeah, I wanna sorta not give you guys headaches. So I'll just sorta be a little bit more careful. Here, I'll zoom you out a little bit. Yeah, that might be a little bit better. <sighs> so. Yeah, I mean, I sorta... I, I, for the longest time, I really thought that I didn't want to do YouTube anymore because I just kind of got bored of playing video games, but that's not really the case. It was really, it was really just because a lot of the games I was playing, I did not really have that much fun playing. And to be honest, Amateur Surgeon, I, I don't hate playing this game, but I, there's a lot more games that I would enjoy playing a lot more. Like, and I can't, and I, I don't know why I'm thinking of this right now. I remember back in middle school, I would like have some friends who, I, I would have some friends. No, I'm a loner. Wait, no, I'm just kidding. Uh. I had some friends in middle school who would tell me that they started playing vid a video game and then they got kind of bored of it and then they just flat out left uh, that this video game in the corner of their uh, in their uh, computer or in their uh, game case collection and then they would just flat out never touch the game again and that to me at the time was a very very foreign concept to me if I bought a video game I was at the very least gonna finish the game and then maybe I would never touch it again but I mean, that's sort of what's happening to me right now. I kind of understand where they're coming from now. I mean, if I never really thought that you know I would get bored of playing something new because I to this day, right now I can actually like list so many games in here. Let me actually show you. And then, to be honest, I don't even have to look at that awesome fire hazard that's going on over there. That's awesome. So here, let me actually lay some of them out. So that is my entire PlayStation 4 game collection, and out of all of them, I have not finished you, I have not finished you, I have not finished you, uh, I have not finished you, and I have not finished you. And to be honest, these two I kind of just got recently, but that's, I mean, if you, know, if you knew me back when I was like a hardcore gamer, if I got a new game, I would finish it probably in two days, maximum two days would be the maximum amount of time needed for me to finish a game. And I think I got these two like over like a couple months ago maybe? I don't know. But anyways, I just never thought that I would be one of those people who would just flat out, you know, get bored of playing a game. And just flat out didn't, would not even want to finish it if I got too bored of it. But apparently that's the case now because I'm a lot older now than I was when I was in middle school and all this was happening. But that, that's really just the bare minimum, guys. If I begin playing a game and I just flat out don't like playing it, I'm gonna have to stop playing it. And I'm gonna have to try something else. Cause I, that's the real reason why YouTubers like start doing this. It's they, even though like, you know, some people might claim otherwise, the reason they start, the reason why any person starts doing YouTube is that they wanna have fun. There's, I really doubt that, you know, they, begin with the mindset of, okay, I'm going to get a million subscribers, I'm going to make YouTube my my career, and I'm going to have the best life ever. Although, if anyone who's gotten to that level, except for certain people who we won't talk about right now, uh, and they, they, you know, may have made big names of themselves already by 
forget, I don't even know how many millions of subscribers do that. You guys probably know who I'm talking about, but I won't go, I don't go, uh, you know, being specific about it. But 99% of people, when they first uh, get into YouTube, they don't really have the mentality of I'm going to get like, you know, a million subscribers and I'm going to, in like a day or a week or something like that. They usually, if they stick around with it and they really do get to that point, they usually start off uh, doing YouTube because they want to have fun doing it. And that's what I, w that's what I was personally aiming at doing at first also. But, that, but as I kept uh, doing YouTube and I, as I kept uh, posting videos, I naturally wanted to get more people to watch me. And I think for about like six months when I first started, I don't think I broke I don't think I even had 100 subscribers yet. I think I still had like maybe 70 subscribers. And to be honest, I didn't even really predict that this number would be as high as it was. And to be honest, it's, I kind of really, really am kind of mad at myself that I just sort of stopped because I was kind of really focused on, on uh, getting subscribers and views. And that's really the reason why I was, you know, trying to I was trying to do this. I was trying to play games that I wasn't really 100% sure that I would enjoy playing, but I just sort of, you know, thought that a lot of people would watch. And if you go into YouTube, that's the really, the wrong personality to sort of, uh, to get into. So that that's the first thing I just want to, you know, say, guys, you know, I'm not going to, you know, I'm, I'm going to try to, you know, post as many videos as possible, even though they may not be videos that make it get a lot of views and to be honest i a lot of these series i probably will actually get around to finishing like i really like playing so ted so i probably will finish so ted at some point although it used to be the case that i <laughs> if i was playing like you know a game i it was kind of like in my mind that i really had to like you know post videos of that series out consistently like i wanted i think when i was playing so ted i sort of wanted to make sure that i was posting uh a Sip Ted's video like once every three days, but some days, you know, I would, you know, kind of feel like I don't really feel like playing Sip Ted's, and maybe I want to play like, you know, Hitman Blood Money, maybe I want to play Super Meat Boy, maybe I want to play Battlefront, stuff like that, but if it really got to a point where like two weeks or like, yeah, if like two weeks went by where I did not post a Sip Ted's video, that would be like, you know, kind of weird, because maybe there's people waiting on Sip Ted's, and maybe, you know, uh, you know, maybe, maybe they want to see a, a Sipted's video and, and they're kind of waiting on it. So what the hell? What if they might get pissed off that they're waiting for a video that, you know, it's not coming out for a while. So what needs, what, and that sucks. It's that, you know, maybe some days I won't feel like playing a game. And, but that's honestly what I have to do because I was following the logic of maybe, you know, I should just play the game anyway. It doesn't really matter. I'm probably having just not a little bit less amount of fun playing a game that I sort of don't really feel like playing rather than a game that I want to play so it shouldn't really matter but that's not the case I really should not have that mentality because the reason why I started doing YouTube is because I wanted to have fun and and any top YouTuber will tell you this also you should never post a video because you want to you know you want to sort of see the view count go up that should never be the case. You should just post videos because you have fun doing it. And when I first started out, that really was the reason why. But when I, as I got later, as I started doing YouTube more and more, like, I remember like six months into, after YouTube, I did not even have 100 subscribers. But to be honest, this number is nothing to even sneeze at. I really do appreciate that this many people are still sticking around, even though... Although, to be honest, it's not even clear how many of these people are still active subscribers. But still, in any case, it's still very impressive, at least to me, that this many people are, at one point, did w care enough about my videos to subscribe. And how, that's like, what? That's like an entire, like, giant high, like, okay, well, even like some. I was going to say, like, if that's like a giant high school, but like, people did my, attended my high school at one point like 20 I think yeah 2500 because there were about like 600 freshmen 600 sophomores 600 juniors 600 se seniors so yeah like two very like all like a little bit more than two very large high schools because my high school was actually pretty big so that's still a lot of people and that I really should not care about that that much I'm already doing a huge impact on 
you know, on people, you know, watching my videos. And I think it's a little bit, uh, you know, unfair to say that if you really uh, do YouTube for for uh, for the money, it's it, that's it's a little bit unfair to like uh, call someone out on doing that because in reality, if you could potentially make something that you have fun with doing your career, you kind of want to make that a possibility and. The thing, though, is that even if it doesn't work out that way, you shouldn't really, you know, you shouldn't really, like, you know, just quit doing this, quit doing that hobby that you really love doing just because it doesn't end up being a career. And for a while, that's sort of, like, you know, the mentality I had, you know, going for me also, but it's sort of a bad thing that I sort of had that mentality because I really did like doing YouTube for a really long time, and it just sort of came to me as an idea later, like, you know, okay, I'm sort of doing well here, I need to sort of get this subscriber count up even higher so that one day maybe this thing will be my career once in, for, uh, uh, you know, once in my life. But there are so many YouTubers that want that, but so many of them, it doesn't end up happening. Just simply, I don't know what it is, it's because they don't, I don't know, just, it's just, it's honestly just a luck, basically, because there are some people who, who, in my opinion, don't even deserve the amount of subscribers that they have. And there are some channels that I see who have like, you know, like 1,000 or 2,000 subscribers that try so much harder than a lot of channels that I see that have like, you know, 1 million subscribers or something like that. But it's, it's honestly just luck. And to be honest, I really should not be getting mad at myself that, you know, if this number doesn't get bigger, because it might not, but I'm, I'm honestly happy with that number. It's it's a fairly decent amount of people and, you know, I should not be getting mad at that. But enough of this, you know, melancholy crap with me being depressed over, uh, you know, people not watching my channel. Because that's, that's, as again, as I've said many times, that's a very good number and I should not be getting mad at that. So, as far as the future holds, I'm primarily just going to play games that I like. And... I'll, I might one day get back to stuff like this. But if I do, it's probably not going to be consistent because I'm going to be completely honest right now. There are more games that I would have more fun playing. And to be honest, like Stick RPG 2, the only reason I started playing Stick RPG 2 is because Stick RPG 1 got a fair... Okay, why is my camera shaking so much? Is because Stick RPG 1 got a really, 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 you know... Well, I wouldn't say large amount of views, but like... For, at least from my channel, it had a fairly decent amount of views. So I just figured, okay, I'll just play part two and see what happens. But again, I shouldn't really have that sort of mentality. I should just be sort of playing games that I like. So when I come back to this, I'm going to... In fact, I have so much footage backed up, it's so ridiculous. I'm going to actually... I'm, I'm not going to promise that I'm going to post a video today or every single day, but I'm going to try my best. And... I honestly should be able to. I mean, it's not even like... If I'm playing games that I like, it's honestly not even that hard to get content out. And another thing also, I'm probably gonna... I have this baby now. So, you know. That's something. Uh, I'm gonna try to... I mean, I, I could have a... I mean, it could be better, to be honest. I don't have, like, you know, an i7 processor or anything. But, you know, it could be better. I mean... Yeah, I, I could start, you know, like, you know, twitching it up, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, man, I have kind of forgot. I've not really shown you guys this entire setup yet. Yeah, so PlayStation 4, chess books, yeah, in case you didn't know. If, you, if you're, like, old-school followers of this channel, you'll know how I'm a kind of a chess geek. Fire hazard over there, water purifier night stand with a bunch of other stuff. So there's some Legos. That's a trash can. That's a box. You kind of saw a glimpse of my finger, but that's okay. Monitor one with the computer next to it. That's a joystick for reasons I don't know. That's my HD PVR for that I use for recording. Although I'm using my iPhone right now for recording. This, I, yeah, this is the only video that's probably going to be on my channel that is using uh, my iPhone. Speaker number one, speaker number two, uh, signed coffee mug by a certain somebody that you guys probably don't know who it is, so maybe I won't 
Well, I probably won't bother saying who it is. Yeti microphone, water bottle, stack of games I just showed you earlier, soda, polar pop cup that I bought yesterday, or last night. Literally two minutes away from my house, I can get these for just a dollar. PS4 controller, a uh, cell phone that I had when I was... You know, I still had this cell phone when I was a senior in high school, I think. Yeah, that's, that's actually kind of sad. Because the iPhone that I'm using right now... Okay, well, actually... Where's it? Oh, yeah, it's over there. That's the iPhone I got my second semester of my senior year in high school, and I still have this freaking piece of crap my first year... Or my first semester of senior year in high school. So, you know, whatever. That's fine. Uh, monitor number two for PlayStation. Speaker one. Speaker two. Uh, and keyboard... I believe that's a multi-tool knife screwdriver thing over there. That's oh yeah, that's my old hard drive from my PS4, and this is my mouse, and that's my giant mouse pad. And those are Altoids, and I think those are Ralph's coupons back there, but I'm not sure. And I know so many of you out there want me to flip the camera over and you want to see what's on the other side of this iPhone, but meh, maybe one day. But that day is not today. Yeah. I don't know. It's To me, it just sort of adds a little bit of a mystery element to me if uh, people don't know who, what I look like for now. I probably will get around to showing you my face, but at least for now. It's probably not going to happen for a while. <laughs> so yeah, guys. And also, I, I don't even think I said this before. I do want to actually deeply apologize for, you know, me just go dropping off the face of the internet for for, uh, for how, as long as I did. Because again, that's a year and a half. And to be honest, you guys deserve better than that. I don't know what it is. It's, to be honest, it's sort, it was sort of like this. When I was, you know, when I was, when I really wanted to upload another video, it was like a month after this one was posted. And then one month turned into two months, two months turned into half a year, half a year turned into a year, and then now we got to where I was, am right now. In fact, I remember, like, it was like, it was like half a year ago that I wanted to make another video, but I just sort of knew in the back of my head that there's not really anything that I would really like to continue, over. I mean, okay, not like to continue is such a strong word, but there's series that you can see right now that I would much rather be replaced by stuff I would enjoy, even if the view count wouldn't be that high. Like, the battle friends with my friend, like, with Blix here, those are, like, hands down my favorite videos to record, and if you can, here, let's see, down, they're hands down, like, my least viewed videos. Here, okay, well, you can maybe not hands down, but they're on the lower side of how many people view them, and, and th that's the problem, though. I really should not care about that, because I still have a lot of people viewing my content anyway so that's what I'm gonna have to do from now on I should really not care if not that many people view my videos because or not, okay, not many of my subscribers view my videos because usually the, it's the case that most of the people that view my videos are su my subscribers so that's what I'm gonna have to do but yeah again I want to deeply apologize guys this was sort of ridiculous that I did not post a video, and at the very least, I could have warned you guys about it. I do have a Twitter. In fact, let's see it. Let's see how many people are on my Twitter. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, March of 2016. It's freaking September. It's one and a half years ago. Ugh. <sighs> Man, I could have at least done something on Twitter, but with my, what is it, like, eight followers? Well, actually, the 31 followers, so, eh, it's not as bad as I thought it was, but it's still pretty bad. Um, but yeah. I'm gonna post a video today. It's gonna be awesome. I have so much footage backed up, it's not even funny. I mean, okay, I'm obviously gonna post this video right now, but you're gonna see another video soon enough today don't worry guys and hopefully you're gonna see another video uh uh every single day after that because it's gonna be awesome i can already see people bashing me for the sort of online wallpaper but 
I don't care. I like that anime. And people who... Uh, people who tell me otherwise that... Can suck it. No, I'm just kidding. You're, you have a right to your opinion, and I have a right to mine. So, I like Sora Online, so I'm not gonna, not gonna complain about it. But yeah, just to give you another look at my apps and stuff. And YouTube channel. Okay, so... I think that's a wrap, guys. Hopefully I'll see you in the next one, and hopefully, maybe, with this little bad boy, we can start doing some other things. And you guys can watch me live if you know what I mean. Alright, that was it, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.